For the first step, you want to head over to search and type in Task Manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure you have no shaders or mods installed on your Roblox game client because this can actually alter your game files and then this error could appear because of it. So if you see any of that, you want to click on it and then click on End Task. For the next step, you want to head over to search and type in CMD, then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Now once you're on this, you want to type in SFC space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. Then you want to run this scan. You can run this scan in the background as you do the next steps in the video. So for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on check for updates and do all the updates that your computer may have. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in system information. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure that next to system type, you have a 64-bit operating system with Windows installed. If you don't, then you need to install it. If you've done all these steps in the video and it's still not working, then you want to head over to search and type in add Ruby programs. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to scroll down until you find Roblox player. You want to click on the three dots and click on uninstall. Then you want to uninstall it. Then you want to head over to search again and type in Microsoft Store. Click on it. Then you want to search for Roblox and then you want to install Roblox again. Now once you install it, you want to reset your computer and then the problem should be fixed.